pro players. Um, all right, guys, so we got seven players in here, free-for-all action, king of the nuke. You guys know what's going on. There's going to be a nuclear silo in the middle of the map. You capture the nuke, you shoot it at your enemies. It's pretty simple. Remember, all these guys start with spy satellites, so all the players can see everything on the map, so there's no hiding in the corners. We got some big names in here today. Should be a banger. Snark in blue up in the top right. Kane in purple on the right side, hiding. Uh, we got Path in red, playing right off the nuke on the right side. Uh, we got Kian, the Octo Kid in teal, bottom right. Oh, but look at that. Path shooting down on the hill at Kian. Kian's in a bad spot. I'm not sure how he ended up there. On the left side, we got green. The Frakes banging out with Artie in yellow. Uh, those guys are going right at each other. Uh, it's always tough to have Artie as your teammate early on, or as your as your neighbor early on. Artie does a lot of work, and the same thing for Kian. Kian pushing now with these GIs, trying to clear him out some space. Uh, and then we got uh, Asan. Asan up in the top. Asan in the top left, chilling. He just double engineered the nuke. He's got an extra engineer. Yeah, Asan understood the assignment. Yeah, don't sleep on Asan, rule number one. He's got three bunkers out and he controls the nuke. I love it. So, uh, Frakes takes the early walk. Um, yeah, you don't want to, yeah, I think for you new players, I know it's daunting to come in here and play with these top level guys, and it is, you know, but if you want to play, obviously you're always welcome to, and, uh, the big thing is, don't deploy next to someone. I know it's slow, you don't want to put yourself out of the game, it won't work, just don't deploy next to someone, just go try to find your own corner and chill there, that's all I can recommend. Oh, and who gets in? Snark gets in and steals that nuke, look at that heist from Snark, I love it, all the way from back right, comes in and grabs that nuke, canceling the timer on Asan, love to see it. Asan now broke, would love to get another engineer, but doesn't have the money for it. Kian in the bottom right, still getting some work done. Kane staying alive on the right side. Uh, we'll see if what Kian tries to get done here. Kian's in a very vulnerable position uh, with almost no units here uh, on the bottom in the bottom middle. Um, if anyone starts picking on Kian, he's going to be in trouble. Nuke coming now for Snark. Oh, is he going to get it stolen? Oh, he gets it stolen. Red's MCV path in a very scary spot here. Being in the middle of the map can be tricky. I mean, it's nice to play the nuke the way Asan is, but if people set their sights on you, you definitely can get pinched out early. Asan is basically playing SimCity. No one's, no one's taking a single shot at him yet. And he is going to get a nuke off here, I think. Uh, so Asan with nice map control and control of the nuke. Looks like Yellow already in the bottom left, uh, getting, a, getting a heist ready. He's got an engineer. He's going to go in and go for the steal. See if he can pull it off here. Okay, okay. And so Kian is finally getting his legs under him. He's got some Grizzlies out, but look at these GIs from Artie. Very, very scary. And the nuke's ready. Asan's nuke. Now, where does Asan go with this nuke? What do you guys think? Um, oh, Kian's in trouble, man. These GIs are going to be scary. If he knows it's... This, this is looking pretty juicy down here. Like right here would be nice. Uh, I don't love that move. A nuke won't kill an MCV unless it hits an oil. Um... Yeah, I don't love that move, but it's okay. Like this, I, like red's juicy. But honestly, you know, your nukes early on, you want to hit the person who's conf who's, who has conflict with you. And in this case, it is yellow. So I think that's a decent move. He could have used it on yellow's army. A nuke right here would have been really nice. Um, and look at that. Artie, Artie comes up and grabs the nuke, but Artie's base is in trouble right now. He has all of his defenses up on that nuke. And Kane wraps his oils around Kian and then blows himself up. But look at Kian. Oh my God, Kian moved his MCV. Wow, Kane, yeah, Kane just tried to, <laughs> was just trolling so hard on Kian, wrapped his oils into Kian's base and then quit out of the game and Kian stayed alive. That's why you call him the Octo Kid. Uh, but Snark's on a rampage right now. A right, lot of Rhinos on the right side. Gonna be coming for Kian. Kian has the Grizzlies to try to hold, but he's gonna be spread pretty thin here. Uh, this nuke, so the nuke, already does have the nuke. Is he gonna get it off? Oh, here comes the nuke. Where's that nuke going? Where's Artie's nuke going? Oh, Snark's doing work. Snark's gonna knock out Kian on the right side. Although Kane did a lot of the heavy lifting. Nuke coming. Nuke coming. Gotta go at Asan, right? Yep. Nice. Three oil chain reaction takes the War Factory. And Asan now has no War Factory and no tanks. And Kian repositions his MCV for the 15th time. He is now literally in Artie's base. I don't think he's gonna find a friend there, but he has to get away from Snark. Snark is just absolutely tearing people apart right now. Massive tank advantage for Snark. Uh, Asan has an MCV, but pretty much nothing else. Asan's on 18k, though. He could try to make something happen. Oh, nice action here on the cliff. Oh, Snark's looking tough. But look, Kian has the GIs. Is Kian going to try to get in and grab that nuke? But he doesn't have any anti-air in that group. He has to be very, very careful. Kian's very exposed right now. The nuke coming from Artie. you got to think it's going to go at Kian. Uh, Kian's base is right next to him. 
Oh, but he goes at Snark, and that's a heads up move, guys. A lot of times with the nuke, you constantly like send it right at the person closest to you, person who's messing with you. But the thing is, um, you know, the person in the corner that you're not worried about, that's the person you've got to try to slow down. Those are the players that win these games nine out of 10 times. Snark, look at him, he has the army. He's up in the top right, he's chilling. I love that Artie's sending those nukes down at him instead of dealing with Kian. Um, you know, they're both enemies, but I think Snark ultimately is the bigger threat of winning this game. Although you never can sleep on the Octo Kid, because uh, literally Kian, um, Kian literally has moved his MCV for the 15th time, and Kian's somehow still in this game. Uh, and another nuke, and Artie has understood the assignment very, very well here, folks. He's playing King of the Nuke, he's playing the nuke, and that's exactly what you need to do. If he can get another nuke off uh, into Snark's base, take out a couple of his War Factories, he's going to be right back in this. Um, and honestly, Snark's army's been melted. I've kind of lost track here. Snark is way more behind than I thought. I think those hits with the nuke on the back end definitely slowed down his macro, and he's really feeling it right now. Artie with a nice army of Grizzlies pushing in here, and Kian's got these GIs doing work. Kian's going to make a run for the nuke now. Now, the nuke's ready. Oh, and, and Artie's going to get another nuke off. Where's that nuke going to go? Is it time to start picking on Kian? We will see. And again on Snark. Snark's taking hits. You can't be eating nukes like that. I know it's hard to hold the nuke. So if you get in there, you send an engineer. Maybe you don't hold it. Maybe you don't send it. But it's worth it to get in there and steal it and cancel it out. You cannot let a player just keep slamming nukes down your throat like this. R-D-O-P, though. That's the name of the game here, folks. Oh, and a little bit of lag coming in. Unfortunate here as we close out the game. Uh, quite, this only had six minutes, man. This has been a, it's been a banger, but uh, you got to think uh, Artie's going to be able to close this one out here pretty quickly. A nice engagement on the left side, but Artie does have the Grizzlies to hold. Uh, Kian's going to start trying to pinch out Artie. It's a good idea. You got to go for the champ. Um, so now Artie's getting pinched out both sides, and... Artie's getting pinched out by Snark and Kian. Artie's in trouble. Where's this nuke going? I was going to say, someone better nuke Kian before he gets his legs under him because Kian's slowly fighting his way back in this game. If Kian wins this game, it will be an absolute epic comeback. I cannot believe this right now, but he's pushing into these prism towers. Oh, he has no anti-air in the group. The, the Rockies are eating him alive. Kian has to steal this nuke, though. If Kian eats another nuke, he will not be able to get out of this game, I don't think. Uh, Kian has the engineer. Can he make the run? The nuke's coming. The nuke's coming. You know it's going to go at Kian. Kian's in trouble. IFV's out now. These Rockies are, are really, really messing with Kian. Kian has this engineer on the cliff. I'm sure he forgot about it. There's so much going on. Kian dives in and gets Artie's MCV. Artie now with no War Factory, but you got to know this, this is coming right here. Yep. And Kian left with nothing but a handful of tanks. This is literally the apocalypse right now. Everyone sticks and stones. Snark still has a couple War Factories, a handful of Rhinos. Artie's pumping uh, on all four cylinders with these barracks. He can still pump Rockies. He's got three barracks and two AFCs, and Artie has the nuke. If the nuke closes out the game, I would absolutely love to see it. Because it's called King of the Nuke. It's not shoots and ladders. It's about the nuke, and ultimately Artie has played the nuke the best. But free for all guys the enemy of your enemy is your friend and i love snark and kian teaming up to knock Artie out that's what had to happen they were too weak to win on their own so you you got to have those little things there's politics involved and and snark eats another nuke uh kian is there enough time oh my god you guys we have another three minutes left in this game kian could come back and win here realistically but someone has to do something about Artie's nuke Artie cannot keep nuking these guys they're not going to be able to survive if he does um but already look at him securing the nuke. He's got the Rockies. He's got the GIs. This is a tough position. Uh, neither of these players have their radars out, so they can't build their anti-infantry units. you got to know that uh, that Kian would love to get a sniper or a Navy SEAL out. Snark would love to get a Desolator out. Oh, Snark does get a Desolator out, but here comes the nuke. On a totally blundered nuke from Artie. Artie doing these guys a huge favor there. Uh, misses absolutely everything there. Uh, very, very well played from Kian to get out of that position. Um... Oh, and so Snark gets the Desolator up and does Kian a big favor cleaning out these GIs now. And things swung back in Artie's favor. Uh, hats off to Artie. I mean, he was ahead for a while. Then he got pinched out so hard, but he got himself back in this. And now Artie has no, he already has no barracks left. Oh my God, Artie has no barracks left, but Artie still controls the nuke. There's another nuke coming. Oh my God. Oh my God. And so there goes the AFC. These guys still just eating nukes, trying to make something happen. There's one minute left in the game. 
This one's going to come down to timer. And I got to tell you, I have never, ever had a situation where I've hated the timer more because I would love to see how the dust settles on this one. Usually in the free for all games, when we hit the 10 minute mark, I'm ready to go home. Uh, in this particular instance, I love to see how things bang out. Let's see if they can try to force something here. Um, Desolators, though, from Snark, they're just going to gum this one up. Uh, the Desolators slowing things down. Another nuke coming. Got to hit Snark and his Desolators. Try to open things up for Kian, hopefully. Um, oh, tries to hit. I don't know. I don't know what he tried to hit there. Oh, my goodness gracious. Yeah, on points, Artie. You got to think Artie was pretty dominant this game, but I'm not sure if uh, super weapons count for points. So the kills you get with a nuke, I'm not sure that calculates into points. And the timer's going to blow. What an absolute banger. Hats off to all three of these players. Um, <laughs> what a banger of a match. Artie takes it home decisively on points and well earned. He played incredible there. Good job, Artie. Artie OP.